This is a credit card review. I don't normally do reviews, but in this situation, I need to give a review. Don't have the card on me because I tore it up. I literally smushed the card and threw it away. Now, I know some of you all may say, well, people experiences are different. It doesn't matter about that, but it does matter a lot because I want someone to let me know if I'm getting myself into something that's going to be havoc and potentially mess up my credit. Well, I was in the mall with my grandbabies, Jim and my babies, and I went in the River Chase Galleria in the mall in Hoover, Alabama, and I saw this children's place, and I decided to go in there with my grandbabies. And they was looking around. I saw some nice clothing. But anyway, I saw a lot of little cutesy things. And my grandmothers love cutesy things. So I'm going to open up a credit card account. I could have paid for it. But I thought, I said, well, I need at least one credit card. For, just for little children. Just for my G-babies. So I can always get them little cute things. And then I can pay it off in the, the month or whenever. So I opened up this account. Which I should never have opened never open up this account and I didn't charge but like a little bit of money on it like 70 some dollars 71 dollars or maybe 30 some at a time and the highest it, it gotten was like 80 dollars maybe and so I will pay it off and pay it but I'm telling you something about children's place they have no 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 type of work with you no grace period no anything and so I would go in there and pay the bill. And just what happened, I was, what, one day or two days late, I wasn't paying attention. It was like one or two days, that's, and I paid the account. And every time you'd be a day late, they would charge you $25. And then when time passed, they increased it. And the, the late fee goes up. <laughs> and, uh, and I would pay it. Then I, I said, I'm, I'm, I'm going to pay this card out. So I decided that I was gonna pay the card out. So I went to the mall, I paid it out. It was a total of like $22 I owed on it. And I paid it out. I thought that's through. I got the card and I bent it up. I said, I'm not gonna use this card. About a month later, I get a call and there's a collection from well, children's place calling me and said, you have a fee, ma'am, you did not pay. You own this card. I said, I paid the card out. And and they said, no, you, you have a $36 late fee for being a day late. And matter of fact, she said I was two days late. I said, you charged me $36, $37 for two days late. They said, yes. And then they, they increased it every time as long as you're late, even though the account is closed out. So, I told the lady, I said, ma'am, I said, why are you all charging me? I said, send me the, send it to me in the mail. Send me something in the mail. Let me see the paperwork on it. I said, I need to check on this account. Either way, time went by and I didn't get anything in the mail. I didn't see anything in the mail, but they called me again. I said, well, okay, I'll tell you what I do. Let me just pay. She said, now ma'am, it's, it's double. Now you owe, um, what she told me, $80. I said, what? She said, it's $80. <laughs> and she said, but I'll make an arrangement with you. If you pay the $36, $37, $38, if you pay that the first month, I'll waive the other month. We'll cancel it and we'll close the account. So I said, okay, that sounds good. And I'll tell you something. I recorded it. I had forgotten I had recorded it, but I did. But listen this, this what happened. So, I paid the $40 with my bank account. And I said, okay. She said, well, the account is closed now. I paid. She said, we dismissed the other month. Okay. The next month, I'm getting another call. I keep getting these calls that I keep ignoring because I don't know who they are. You know how you get all these spam calls. Eventually, I answered the call. And 
I was told, yes, ma'am, uh, this is, I'm calling for Children's Place Community Bank, and you owe $80 on this account. And I said, sir, I said, I paid the $40, and <laughs> this account is closed. Oh, yes, yes, I see where you closed the account, but you have not paid the money for the account. So it's still not technically closed. It's not going to be closed. It's still incurring interest and payment until you pay this last amount. So there still was adding on to it, and they didn't close the account, and they saying, I still need to pay it. I've never seen such a thing in my life where they just determined to keep getting money out of me out of after I have supposedly closed the account. So what I'm going to do as of right now, and I let you all know later on what happened, I'm going to send my recording. I looked in my bank statement. I couldn't find it, so I'm going to go to my bank. I'm going to have to go to the bank and let them find it for me because I got many transactions in there and I other transactions I saw with forty dollars. So, I'm I, but I have the recording, so I'm gonna have to go to the bank and check it out. But I've been having such a hard time with Children's Place. I would not advise anyone to get the card of Children's Place because if you do, you better make sure you're not one minute over the twenty-four hour. If it's twelve and you over twelve oh one, you are late. They're gonna charge you triple i didn't owe but 22 dollars, and yet they charged me 38 dollars for being two days late after i had closed and i told her i paid the, it out they still continue to hold the account open and charging me fees on the account this is not this is a children's credit card can you believe it a children's company so i want to let you all know just in case that's my experience that I've had with Children's Place. So it's up to you if you want to have an account with them, but I would not. Those fees, the interest is like, oh, off the top. 29, 30 percent interest. I've never heard of such a thing. So that's my experience I've had with Children's Place. Now their services through community bank that's what the, he was telling me over the phone that's it for now i'll see you all later bye bye